What is up, YouTube? This is Count Bladwin coming at you. How's everybody doing? Great, I hope. Well, I'm still in the Smoky Mountains. I'm looking at a salamander climbing up a wall right now, which is pretty cool. Red-headed salamander. Uh, still looking for bears. Seen one yesterday, but one ain't come through today. pretty nice up here it's quiet um, there's even though there's people in other condos here uh, everybody's really respectful quiet so this is a pretty killer place to go and relax for me um, but some of my viewers wanted to see some spider cove slip joints and while I was at Smoky Mountain Knife Works, I decided to pick up a few. Now, I was pretty much, <laughs> I didn't have a lot to spend at the store anyway. Uh, so I got what I could get. And this is one of them. And it's a, a really nice little slip joint. This is the Grasshopper. Now, these are made in the Chinese uh, factory for spider co which is not a big deal to me because the spider co factories they're all pretty much the same but this is the spider co grasshopper really awesome little slip joint not too big but This is 12 CR 27. But nice little little spider co. Uh, now spider a little more on the expensive side. You know, they do have some budget minded models, but you know, even though uh, some are budget minded some are still pretty pricey but this one is $26.99 in the store uh, and that's with the black wash blade um, so normally when it's a black wash blade they're a little more expensive but you still got your spider co hole no no clip or anything because this is a a smaller knife nice little I mean everything about it spider co feels like spider co it's comfortable I can get all four fingers bunched on the the handle but now this is a three finger knife for most people no doubt for twenty six ninety nine you know for a little little slip slip joint knife you can throw down in your pocket and forget about it uh, that's pretty cool uh, now the only thing is is the spider co hole is always made spider co's a little tall right here but if you're into spider co's then that's not an issue just makes it a little taller taller than a normal knife but you know, great looking little blade. Nice little slip joint. This is legal everywhere um, because it's a slip joint. Good little pocket knife to have around. Especially if you live in a place where, you know, they give you a hard time on... Uh, uh, locking blades or or a bigger style blade over so many inches but this one you know I, I wouldn't see a reason why it wouldn't be legal everywhere oh my gosh that is like butter this is why I like spider toe 
it doesn't matter what plant it's made in, they're always gonna be just one of the sharpest knives right out of the box of any company out there. I mean, you can't beat that at all. I'm trying to not cut all the way through the paper because I have to keep this area clean. You know, I am in a national park, actually. But, I mean, to me, this Spyderco right here is absolutely perfect for every place on the planet. You know, $26.99, you really can't beat that at all. Um, so if you're new to my channel, welcome. Thank you for stopping by. Smash that like button or stab it since it's the knife community. Stab that like button. Share, subscribe means the world to me, but only takes a second of your time. And I appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. I do. Whether you think I don't do or not, I, I absolutely do. I love my community. I love my, my people, like my regulars. Y'all are all awesome. Uh, now, also, if you're new to my channel, I do a paracord test. I do a push through, then I do a slice. The push through is more the tail of the grind of the blade because it's just sheer friction cutting through the paracord. And this is 550 paracord. And then I do the slice second because all knives should slice. Even, even a dull knife will slice. So, let's see if I can get enough leverage on this little one to, wow, okay, that was effortless. That was absolutely effortless. Let's see if we can get a good slice. Of course, we will. Very little effort. Clean cut. I mean, that's just about as clean as you can ask for. Let's see if we can get a pop with this little thing. No, but maybe. Boy, it just it just like cuts right through. That's that's awesome. No, not gonna get a pop, but I tell you what, the way it's cutting through, I mean look how clean that is that's just insanely clean I tell you what spider co's got it going on I really like their stuff uh, I like all kinds of knives I look like traditionals I like moderns I like a lot of these different knives out here but spider co they cease to impress me uh you know a little slip joint like this and cuts like that is insane well what do y'all think do y'all think it's a worthy slip joint um i think this is perfect for any environment for any person uh, it doesn't matter where you live europe uh england you know where they have many knife restrictions uh ireland same thing any cities in the united states that have restrictions on certain knives this one will pass all restrictions it's perfect so anyway i hope everybody enjoyed the knife i do uh this may be a giveaway item for me later uh, to one lucky viewer out there I know that I've got some of the best people in the world and I try to take care of them as much as they take care of me so we'll just have to see uh, I'm waiting for the thousand subscriber mark I got something pretty good planned for it but around 750 or so I'll probably give another knife away possibly this one too so i hope y'all enjoyed the video thank you for letting me ramble up here in the mountains and stuff and being a part of my life too 
I appreciate it. And as I always say, I hope your belly's full. I hope your refrigerator's full. And for the love of everything, I hope your gas tank's full. And we'll see you next time.